Hello and welcome back to my first ever video. Now, today we are going to build a vacation villa. And you can see what we're going to have to do. Let's go. As you can see, I've pretty much built a town. Going right through here. Boring. Okay, that's all we need right now. So let's just start building.
now. This area will be the, you know, living room area. Okay, let's see. Okay. So we are going to get a bulldozer. And we'll make it easier. No distraction. Okay. Ah, this is the only area I need to destroy. My hand. Perfect! Look at this! We can put on the wood flooring later. Okay. Okay, let's do some gold dough again. 
subscribe. Hey everyone, it is Mr. Crayfish and today I am once again creating your mod ideas in Minecraft. Now today's episode is going to be a little bit different. In today's video we are going to be creating mods based around a certain theme. And that theme today is everything to do with mining, caving and exploring. So I asked you guys on Twitter if you could have a simple mod created for Minecraft, what would it be? And as always, you guys suggested so many amazing ideas. However, I've picked four ideas that really stood out. Now, if you would love to suggest a mod idea for the next video, go ahead and follow me on Twitter. There are links in the description below and I'll be asking real soon for more ideas. However, on that note, let's start creating your mod ideas. So the first idea comes from a user called Moonshiner and they suggested to add in a gold hopper. 
I can't count the amount of times I've come back from mining or even exploring and having to sort out all my items. Minecraft is continuously adding more places to explore every update and that means more items. And with the nether update around the corner, gold is going to be much more plentiful. So why not add some more uses? Having that said, let's start coding this mod. Alrighty, so I went into this mod thinking that it was going to be quite straightforward, but it turns out there are some difficulties along the way. But the first stage of this mod was to simply add in a new block, um, and within a few minutes I had something working. We should have it in the redstone tab here, so if you scroll down, there it is, the golden hopper without a, uh, <laughs> without a model yet. But we should be able to place it down and it uh, looks like everything's working so far. Obviously, it looks like a hopper right now, but uh, that will change soon. And that it did because the next stage to this mod was to create a texture for the golden hopper. Now, it is still my goal this year to get better at texturing and uh, let's just say the first texture I created didn't really look too good. What the heck? It looks like a sponge. <laughs> Alright, so I went back to the drawing board and uh, created the texture from the ground up and now it looks a lot more like gold. Now the texturing is out of the way, it's time to move on to the main portion of this mod and that is adding in the functionality. Now I love making mods that fit into vanilla Minecraft and I thought that the perfect functionality for the golden hopper would be to replicate something similar to the redstone item sorter. So the golden hopper is only going to be able to filter one item at a time just like the redstone system. You may or may not be familiar with this design but one of the disadvantages of this system is you can only filter items that can stack up to 64. The golden hopper is going to be able to filter any item. It is also going to cost considerably less with the gold hopper only costing five golden ingots and one chest. And after many hours of writing code and learning how hoppers work, and to be honest, I still don't know how they completely work, we finally had a working version. All right, so now when we right click on the hopper, we'll open up this nice window here. And as you can see, it looks very similar to a normal hopper, but we have this extra slot at the front here, which is for the item you wish to filter. So if I was to place a diamond sword in the filtering slot, as you can see, I can chuck the diamond sword in. However, if I chucked a golden sword, it's just going to sit on the top. Now, if you take the item out of the filtering slot, it is just going to act as a normal hopper. So you can actually chuck anything 